Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about our volcano lap book. We studied volcanoes for about six weeks and we just recently ended with a big volcano that we have built and we have done some experiments with it and that video will be linked below. So this is our lap book that we created and all I did was take a folder, fold it in half, we cut out some cardstock and done our volcano left room for decoration this is what you see when you first open it so we have our little volcano trivia over here we've got our erupting volcano that Mason drew for colored <laughs> then we have this how a volcano erupts and it just goes into detail on how um, what makes a volcano erupt this is types of volcanoes. Mason mostly done this. Um, Riley did too, she learned as well, but um, he done most of the like illustrations. So this is just a definition out of an old um, children's dictionary or something that we cut stuff up out of. And we just glued it in there. So then you go this way. You have what volcanoes can do for you. And we just filled that in. And who's going to blow. And it talks about active, dormant, and extinct. Ones. Lots of tape in this lot book. Okay, so then you open it up. and get the full, full view. So this is Riley's art. Riley did a V lesson. V, for, v is for volcano and done her little volcano art. Mason done the um, basics of a volcano. And we labeled it. We did eruptions from history. And taped those. We went over those. Then we did map of volcanoes. So we did the, um, the volcanoes that are on here. And then we um, pinpointed them on the world map and I just printed this off on one cut these out cut this out really neat um, these and this one this one and this um, I just got off of various um, websites I, I can't even remember um, I was printing some maybe teachers pay teachers and then just some those are really neat lap book and I think I got this one and this one from and um, some of the other ones with the trivia um, so they did like this big unit study on it um, and I just took what I thought my kids would like to know what would relate to them and what they would understand so um, that is our lap book we left room for improvement room for additions we plan to visit Yellowstone this fall. Uh, my husband's got to work out there, so we're going to be there for like a month, um, right at the Teton Mountains. So um, that'll be exciting. I figured they might want to come back and put some, oh, we learned this, and we saw this, and um, maybe take some pictures of the volcano they built and put in here, and just so they have it um, anytime they learn anything new about volcanoes they can come back and add on and we can add on another page to open here or to open this way that's the great thing about lab books is they leave um, you get so much information and it's so fun uh, this this was the first science lap book that we've done we've done them with like little things preschool type things with like seasons and shapes and stuff but this was the first like unit study that we've done and this is by far helped them like that information stick now my kids choose what they want to learn about as far as um science right now history a little bit we're fixing to start mystery of history but um this was their idea to start they wanted to learn about volcanoes we watched Netflix videos, we watched YouTube videos, and um, I think that kind of sparked their interest about 
volcanoes so um, they can tell you pretty much anything and everything <laughs> now uh, I will link the video below to our volcano that we made and experimenting with um, erupting it and um, that's all if you have any questions let me know